subscribe, support, stay positive. Hey folks, whoa, well, welcome back to Tommy Vlog 72. And uh, so right now I'm just here at the Louise's here. Delicious, just had my breakfast. I, you could see that on Twitter and Instagram and Facebook. And I'm here with the gentleman, what's your name, man? My name is Chris. Your name is Chris. You know what Chris is doing here this morning? He works a long, hard job as a baker. Yes, a baker. He goes and makes bread and all that stuff. And I was talking with him. We've been having a lot of interesting conversations. And Chris decided that he wanted to have a beer. But the thing is, North Carolina law allows it. What is it with North Carolina law? 7 a.m. That's the first time you can start selling it, even in a convenience store. It's rough. I'll tell you what. Yeah, so I'm sitting here with Chris and having some good conversations. And I thought I'd start vlog 72 and uh, I'll just explain folks before any of you call me lazy last night was a big thunderstorm am I right man it was a gorgeous thunderstorm it was phenomenal just like a kind of thunderstorm that you sit on your porch and watch and observe and admire you know you don't do shit you don't you don't fucking start a blog no uh-uh that's my piece. Uh, but um, honestly, uh, I uh, I couldn't do Tommy Toss because my power just kept going out. So that's I started the show. I started you know the hangout where I was going to start the show from, and then it just thunder and lightning, and I just uh, couldn't do it. So just that's the reason why I didn't do it. And so I'm preparing myself for vlogger fair, and uh, things are just going well right now. Just down here in beautiful Black Mountain. And he's coming up out of his Audi. Is that an Audi? I can't tell. <laughs> but he, you know, hmm. looks well groomed. He looks like he just woke up. Yeah. For people watching this morning, it's See, interesting that people watch. That's what I'm doing anyway. Hmm. But you know, uh, we'll catch you later, folks. Hey, folks. So I'm just here right now. And that is what you think that is. That is a two by four that has gone into a tree. I'm trying to get over here so I can get a good picture of it. And it's, yeah, it's planted right in there. get over here. I was walking down this way. And that is a two, yeah, I looked at that, that's a two by four. I don't know where it came from, but I'm over here in the, the trail. And I saw this and I'm like, I don't know if I've walked past this all, my, all this whole time I've been walking here. But I wanted to get some pictures of it because I'm like, there must have been a strong wind. We've had some strong winds in the past. And um, just boom, it's just in there. And the tree has, no one's pulled it out. To the point where it just, the tree has absorbed it. Excuse me, but I wanted to show that to you guys. But well, there's my bag right there. Put my bag there. I was gonna take a picture of my tablet, but I didn't want to fiddle around with my bag. But well, tonight's Monday night, and I'm heading over to. I was watching. I watched Money Night Raw with Ashley, and um, so you know. And I just want to say sorry that Tommy talks. I had here's the thing. I had planned to do Tommy talks. I was gonna go through with it and do it. Do Tommy talks, and uh, um, basically to the point where nature wouldn't let me. And a lot of you are going to say, yeah, because nature doesn't like you, Tommy. Nature hates you, Tommy. You know what? <laughs> I don't care what you say. But, you know, 
Each to his own. Each to his own. Everybody has an opinion. Everybody has opinions. They're like bubbles. They can pop them. But, uh, so, I uh, wanted to show you that little image. And I'll catch you a little later, folks. Guys, so right now I'm here at Foreign Exchange. And they have all sorts of foreign foods here. Oriental market here all sorts of creative and delicious Like look at this. That's not even English. That's that's like Chinese right there. That's awesome like that, I'm sorry if I'm wrong But uh, like they have all sorts of stuff. That's really not served Here in our in, in this country, and it's awesome. I think it's epically awesome It's a gigantic fan right there. It's working hot sauce everything you could want there's Hamza, 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 with a bunch of Hamza, Hamza, Hamza in his hands. Tell me what you want, tell me what you need. And all their essentially canned goods right here that you could see as we walk through the store. And, uh, ah, I don't know what that is. Hmm? I'm a vlogger. Very nice. Yes. And uh, all sorts of creative things. Do you like this place, ma'am? I do. It's everything you could imagine and then Sorry. And all of their nice little Tupperware and dishes here. Very. Ooh. Okay. Pepper challenge. See how many peppers you could put in your mouth at one time. Watch out, sir. Yes. And did you say they have different candies here. It's awesome and epic. What you doing? Just shooting a video for YouTube. I'm a vlogger. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, it would be nice if you had asked permission prior. I'm sorry. I'm... It's okay. Uh, it's just that it's good etiquette when you're in a small business. Uh -huh. That's mostly because, you know, like, I'm working over here and if you actually got a shot of me, I'd be like, oh, I'm gross. I'll wash my face. Kind of polite stuff. Oh, sorry. I was just... It's okay. I just thought your business was awesome. Well, thank you. We appreciate it. What's yeah. your name? My name is on YouTube Tommy NC 2010. Oh, this will be in this this uh, this segment will be in Tommy Vlog 72. Oh, very cool. You should write that down. You should let me write that down when we get done. Okay. Let me finish mopping, but then I'll get a post. Thank you. I'll yes. Pick it up. Okay. Yeah. He's even in it. Also, all my some of my videos. This guy over here. Oh, okay. Very cool. Yeah. Well, folks, I'll catch you a little bit later. If you ever are here in Black Mountain and you are wandering around and you see Ashley's mom sitting on her, this is her meditation spot. Her underneath a tree. Underneath a tree. Comfortable tree. And Try it out. Make sure you don't break it. Oh, you think this thing's gonna break? Look at the dang log that's holding us. I bet that one log's 300 pounds itself. Yeah, so I'm just sitting here with Ashley's mom, and uh, she calls this her meditation bench. bench. You do realize what meditation is? You sit and meditate. You sit in a position with your with your legs. You don't have to sit in a position. You just sit and my uh my and relax your brain and think. My my uh, my the guy the guy I'm going to see, Chris Perillo, he uh he meditates. He uh. That's like, good, but I'm just saying you don't have to sit a certain way to think. Yeah. You know, you can sit anyway. Just whichever makes you feel comfortable. I'm fixing to dig up a uh, bush. Really? Yes. I'm going to go back here and find Steve's shovel. Because as you see right here, I have two bushes in front of the house. And there's an empty space. And, uh -huh. I, and I need to fill that space with a bush. Which space? Right here. Right here? Yeah. What's wrong with that just being empty right there? I don't like it. I want there, bush. Wasn't there a bush right here before? Yeah, but it died. It did? Yeah. During winter time? I don't know what happened. It just died. So, I'm going to dig up this over here. I wish Steve's sister would come get that dress off for it. She's trying to come back. By the way, everything you're saying has been recorded. Oh, well. You have to do it for me. I can't. I don't want to. Get a shovel. Get a shovel. 
You know, you're missing Raw. Why are you not inside watching Raw? Because I, I'm cooped up inside all day at Mom's. And this is relaxation for me, just getting out here and working in the yard. But folks, I'll catch you a little bit later. And I'm just hanging out with Ashley's mom right now. And see you guys later. Bye-bye. You want to meet the worst crack addicts ever. Those are called hummingbirds. These are hummingbirds, and uh, they are piggies. They uh, they can uh, they can suck down all that just in one day. That whole that the whole that whole container. They didn't. I don't think they would like me filming them. But uh, oh, there's a the temperature. Well, I'll catch you later, folks. And I'm gonna go into town. I have to do some stuff. So, uh, I'll see you guys a bit later. And, uh, adios. Hey, folks. So, uh, today is the last day of July. And, um, so starts the countdown to Vlogger Fair. And uh, that, nothing in the world can stop me from going to Vlogger Fair now. Nothing. And um, I'm really excited. Um, I haven't got any breakfast this morning. I'm hungry. So I'm going. It's a debate. I think I'm going over to a local business called Louise's. And I don't know if you guys recognize this place. The Mill. The mill's doing some construction to make their building bigger. I did a video of them a while back ago. But uh, there is their, there is a restaurant right there. And it looks like a normal house, but it's not. It's a restaurant. So, um, we're going to go up here, go into Louise's. Louise's. Catch you later, folks. Folks, so right now I am just hanging out here and um, I'm just uh, I'm working on some needle felt, and um, this right here is going to be. Um, a guy especially wanted me to design this. This is his head. And that is Mark Hyder. The man that singly handedly bought my. This is the man you can thank for purchasing my ticket for Vlogger Fair. 
There he is. Oh, don't blush, Mark. Don't blush away from the camera. Oh, that's right. He doesn't blush from the camera because you want to know why? Mark has his own channel. You know, he dips his balls and everything because you know what? Because he is a guy that is really generous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mark's a little shy. Oh my gosh, I found my berries. Those are my berries. <laughs> oh, there's a video that I, um, there's a video that I saw on Facebook. Hold on a second, where is it? Damn it. Um, just a second, I want to show you the video. It's hilarious. Hey folks, so this is what I want to show you. I saw this on Facebook. It's hilarious. God. But uh, this is the guy right here, I think. That's his uh, Facebook right there. And uh, I just checked out his Facebook. And uh, he looks absolute. Uh, I've watched some, looked at some of his stuff. And he, he looks really funny. There he is right there. And I've just got done watching some of his stuff. And it looks, some of his stuff on here on Facebook is pretty funny. But that's his name right there. And I just got done watching his video. I'm not sure if that's him. But, um, but it's really funny. So, yeah, also I'm just chilling here and hanging out with Mark. And, um, right now I've just been, uh, working on this. My needle felt. And also I want to show you this. Where did you... Where is my... Oh my gosh, I found my berries! And that is needle felt. And also, I'll be working on, I'll be getting back into more production of needle felting. So I will be making uh, figures. I have one request for a Jason Voorhees, so I'll be working on that at some point. And, oh yeah, by the way, this is what I want to show you. I got all this right here. You know how much all this was here? Nine, $19. Only $19. For this whole bag of needle felt. Thank you to thanks to Earth Guild in Asheville. That I, I they're really good people and they have a lot of needle felt and so there'll be more figures being produced soon. But right now I'm in the hangout with Mark Hyder Samboni Minori Mazori, if you don't want to mean crazy cuckoo crazy guy with with pulling off the you know, the uh, porno star mustache, because I tell you what, <laughs> if you get a look at Mark, he, this is the kind of guy, now this is not me being rude, but if I was to, if there was a, 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 a B porno film, I think Mark would be the <laughs> I don't mean Mark Hyder joke around, but I appreciate him very much, and I'll be doing something for him since he has done this awesome thing for me. But uh, just to say, things are going well right now. Um, I am uh, been exhausted. I'm staying home tomorrow. I'm not going out on Friday. I'm just gonna stay home, sleep in, do some needle felting, get this figure done, get a hold of John. John is uh, another guy, Front Page Tech, YouTube.com slash Front Page Tech. Uh, very cool guy. And I'll catch you later, folks. Bye bye. Hey guys, well, I just want to let you know this is the look that I'm going to be wearing to Vlogger Fair. And uh, I'm sorry to be talking about it again. Um, it's just, I'm, you know, you guys don't realize how excited I am to go to this event. So I'm very, you know, it's a zoot suit jacket and. Uh, had to buy these pants because the pants didn't fit me so I'm wearing the vest my normal vest and this is a new zoot suit jacket and wearing this hat right here so this is the whole ensemble together 
I'm going to take it off and put it, you know, hang it back up so it'll be ready for vlogger fair. And, uh, I'm just needle felting. Doing a little needle felting right here. And, uh, there's, uh, John from front page. This, this right here is going to be, oh, dang it. Let's drop John's head. Um, this is going to be John from front page tech. Right there. I know it doesn't look like much. But that's going to be John from front page, front page Tech. I'm working on his body right now, his full body. And uh, those go for $20. I'm starting to work, and there's my needle felt right there. My tan needle felt, and there's all my stuff here. That doesn't need to be there. Neither does that newspaper. Stuff ends up just laying here because I'm just in the process of working. But, uh,. This is the whole look. Hello. Sleeves are kind of long. But, uh, so this is my whole look for Vlogger Fair. How I'm going to look at Vlogger Fair. I'm excited. I can't wait people what people are going to say when they look at my look. So it's going to be different. Interesting. And, uh, I'll catch you a little later, folks. Hello? Hi, I'd like to order your uh, home style chicken sandwich grilled combo. Hello? Uh, what sandwich is that? A home style chicken sandwich combo. Okay, and what drink would you like to have? Um, a sweet tea. Okay, is it a small, medium, or large? That's a, that's a medium. Anything else for you? Nothing else. That's good tea, thank okay. you. Okay. Huh? Okay. Watch this.
vlog. So folks, I'm gonna end off Tommy vlog 72. Here's Ashley, she just got off work. And she helped me do this. She, I, I, she, I saw her right out of leaving uh, the store and I said, you wanna be part of a social experiment? Basically what I did this morning is I walked into McDonald's' drive through because they had a long line. I didn't wanna deal with the line. So what I did is I walked to the drive through and they ended up shorting me. They didn't give me my, uh, they didn't give me something, so I got really mad and went back there. Didn't make a video about that. So, folks, this is the end of Tommy Vlog 72. And uh, as always, I'm keeping you on the inside fact. Hey, folks, so I'm just chilling down here. Um, Tom's, where are we? Gotta, gotta be so, we're at this place right here. What's the name of the name? That's the name of the on the sign. What's the name? Adam Dalton Distillery. Adam Dalton Distillery here in Asheville. No, Adam Dalton. Adam Dalton. Par and Pub? No, not Par and Pub. Distillery. Distillery. And we're just chilling down here, having a great time. And Hamza invited me down here to listen to some reggae music. I don't know if it's reggae music or if it's going to be grilling and cooking. It's going to be psychedelic. Psychedelic, man. You know, reggae and some rock and bruggen and Bob Dylan and, you know, craziness. Oh, yeah. oh, we're going to have a bobsled team. And then jump around and say early swirly. <laughs> but mixing it up and just chilling, having a great time. And uh, you know, I'll catch you a little bit later, folks. And there's Hamza. Catch you later. Hey folks, it's me, Tommy NC2010. This is Tom this is Tommy Vlog 70. Now I finished my video by going through a um you know, by going through there. I had shot some other f videos with uh, Hamza. I went out to a music event. So, um, I'm just putting these videos together as Vlog 72. Give it a little juice, a little angst. So, if I said this is a separate video and I said keeping you on the inside fact, it's just I didn't realize I was going to put this together in one video. So, that's what I'm just going to do here, folks. I hope you enjoy. You Tommy Hits get the thirst of sicking your teeth into my life and enjoying little bits and pieces of what I'm doing when I'm filming and vlogging and um, just by the way um, I think um, I'm going to uh, what, how many days do I have I have uh, let me get my phone out just to see how many days I have until I leave one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven 12, 13, 14, 14 more days. So I will not be shooting a video until 14 days unless I shoot an independent day vlog. But um, in 14 days, I will start the super vlog, which here is the 16 gig memory card, which I will be using to take to with me. To sh I will be shooting separate videos with my, with my tablet. So Folks, hope you enjoy the footage and have a nice day. And as always, you know how what I always say. Yep, catch you later. <laughs>
throwing around here. So, it's really interesting to do this. This is what you uh, fix your, you know, I don't I know the name for it. I'm not stupid, but it's uh, the chop for your pool cue. Like Jackie Gleason. And, uh, like uh, Jackie Gleason in that picture. He's always frozen in that picture forever and ever. With, you know, get ready to shoot that shot. I don't know what, uh, I can't remember his name, what his particular name on that movie was. If anybody can remember that picture from my room. But I can't remember, I can't remember the name, the character he played. Something fat. Um, that's what I remember. But remember, life is like this pool ball. Simple. And it can hit you at any time. You know, life can change at any moment. Anything can happen, you know? Because all of us as people exist in this world because we live on this little orb. We live on this gigantic orb called Earth. And soon I will be traveling across the United States to meet some of the other entertainers that are. And I left my drink over there. And I'm supposed to leave, drink some pool table. So I forgot about that. But yeah, I'm just chilling right now. Get my drink. So. Gonna go in here. Here's some of the interesting artwork here. Place that we're chilling at. It's very nice, chill, good vibes, and uh, mellow padello, like a jello. And we're just hanging out here, having a good time. Beautiful sunset. Beautiful sunset. As simple as clicking a button. We'll get some more footage. Right. So right now me and Hans are kind of in the pickle right now because Hans's lights shut off as we were going up the hill and Hans is texting his girlfriend right now. Yeah, Jamaica. Jamaica bobsled team. Cool runnings. Cool runnings. Bacon cookies. What was the thing you said earlier? You said 
cool runnings then you said swirly. Swirly. You said whirly swirly. Whirly swirly murly. What does that have to do with anything? I have no idea. You don't remember why you said that? No, I don't. But, oh, by the way, we were just here and this old man, how old is he, Hansa? He said he was 76. I think he was in his 50s. He said he was 76 and he had this 25-year-old girl staying at his house that was a roommate with him. And apparently women, older women, get jealous of him because he has a younger woman staying with him. So I said that's kind of like the opposite in the, like, old women should, young women should be with old guys so the old guy can get a woman because then she'll think, wow, this guy is somebody, he has like a young girl and then I have to tell him his hotsy totsy to run off and then these old guys don't have to be lonely. You see, the one thing as I see is interesting is these, a lot of times when these elderly men lose their wives, they shouldn't give up, they shouldn't wait for death, they should try to find somebody young, you know, and beautiful, and just keep living their life until they die. And then leave the hot girl all the money. <laughs> and watch the family get slowly ticked off and just be like, you're not supposed to have that money. We're supposed to have that money. That was supposed to be our money from our father. Hamza's busy working right now. And I've tried doing the old-fashioned American ingenuity, banging on it, but it didn't seem to work. Hamza said not for me not to do that. Nope, no, no use banging. Not doing anything. Bam, bam! Oh, I thought I saw something for a second. Wait, wait, wait. Nope, that's, that's just reflection. We're here at Ingalls. And this is different angles. We're here trying to get this thing fixed. This might be just a kind of a day vlog or something like that, but I'll figure out what I'm doing here. Wow. When I at my angles At my angles, they have the old, the new buggy. See, that, folks, this is an angles. This is the old fashioned. This is the old fashioned buggy that they've had. One thing I'll tell you about this, folks, is when you're pulling this thing, and uh, there is nothing to hold this thing back. You know what this thing does to you? That's what it does to you. It crushes the crap out of your hand. So back in the day, when I used to pull these buggies. In the parking lot, used to crash the crowd, the wind would blow and it come down on my hands. I was like, dang it, ouch! So, you know, that's what an old, that's what an old fashioned buggy looks like at, at Ingalls. And uh, we're at, this is an older store here, so I'll keep you up to date and see what, what happens. There's Hamza, we're at Ingalls, and we're just, um, Waiting for the inedible and, you know, so I'll catch you a little bit later, folks. Bye-bye. So, folks, Nurika, that we just got the lights back on. So, Hamza should be able to take me to the straightaway, and I'll be heading home. So, uh, yeah, the lights are fixed right now. And uh, I don't know if I'll do any more footage, but there's Hamza. Again, I keep saying there's Hamza. You guys know who he is right now. Y'all know who I am right now. You know, you know who I am, who I am, who I am, you know who I am, who I am. Let's get out of here, Bozo. Hey, don't call me Bozo. Why not? You wanna know why Hamza has all these things? Because his is girlfriend Bozo hit the top thing? of the car. Is Bozo bad? Yeah, Bozo's bad. That's the name of a clown. But you're like, you're always jocular and like, be positive and you know. Oh, down with trolls. That's pretty clowny. I don't know if you can see us right now, folks. Hopefully my... You didn't shut your door on. Didn't? That's what that beeping noise is, folks. Is my door is not shut. Yeah, so, I, folks, right now, um, Hams is taking me up to the house, and, uh, I think uh, there's not, nothing more to do with this video. You straight away, straight away, 
Straightaway Cafe if you want to get a decent burger. Do you Come think on. I should just go to Black Mountain and go up, or do you think I should go this way? Maybe Black Mountain, Hamza. Probably the best thing, so if anything, we don't have any more to go wrong here. But uh, as always, I'm Tommy NC2010. I'll see you in another video, and I'll be uploading vlog uh, 72. And um, I will be working on editing vlog 72. There's a lot of footage. Wait a minute, are the lights off again? Let me go check. Uh, yeah, please. Just jump out and check. Homs is in his Kakatakata cars. Yes, lights are off again. Yes. Let me, let me, one more time, let me check one more time. Yes, they're off. <sighs> no, we did not. Serenity now, serenity now. That's all I have to say. Hannah was trying to figure out if she should come get us. I don't know if the lights are back on. I need you to just put that down. Catch you later, folks, keeping you on the you know, inside fact. Get out 